The flagship Turbo S version of the Taycan can generate up to 750 horsepower of power in combination with launch control and overboost, while the Taycan Turbo can produce up to 670 horsepower. The Taycan Turbo S will therefore accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 2.6 seconds, while the Taycan Turbo can complete this sprint in 3.0 seconds. The top track speed of both all-wheel drive models is 161 miles per hour. The Taycan is the first production vehicle with a system voltage of 800 volts instead of the commonly used 400 volts for electric cars. This is a particular advantage for Taycan drivers on the road. Under ideal conditions, the charging time from 5 to 80 percent state of charge is just 22.5 minutes, with a maximum charging power peak of up to 270 kilowatts. The overall capacity of the 800 volts high voltage battery is 93.4 kilowatt hours. The Taycan Turbo S and Taycan Turbo have two exceptionally efficient electric machines, one on the front axle and one on the rear axle, thus making the cars all-wheel drive. Both the range and the continuous power of the drive system benefit from the highly efficient permanently excited synchronous machines. The electric machine, transmission and pulse controlled inverter are each combined into a compact drive module. The modules have the highest power density of all electric powertrains on the market today. A special feature of the electric motors are the hairpin windings of the stator coils. This technology makes it possible to incorporate more copper in the stator, increasing power output and torque while maintaining the same component volume. The two-speed transmission installed on the rear axle is an innovation developed by Porsche. First gear lets the Taycan prioritize acceleration from a standing start, while second gear, with its long gear ratio, ensures high efficiency and equally high power reserves while traveling at high speeds. Porsche uses a centrally networked control system for the Taycan chassis. The integrated Porsche 4D chassis control analyzes and synchronizes all chassis systems in real time. The innovative chassis systems include adaptive air suspension with three-chamber technology including PASM electronic damper control, as well as the optional Porsche Dynamic Chassis Control Sport Electromechanical Roll Stabilization System including Porsche Torque Vectoring Plus. The all-wheel drive control with two electric motors and the recuperation system are unique. At up to 265 kilowatts, the potential recuperation power is significantly higher than that of competitors. Driving tests have shown that approximately 90% of everyday braking is performed by the electric machines alone, without the hydraulic brake system being activated. The cockpit signals the start of a new era of interior design at Porsche with its clear structure and a completely new architecture. The freestanding, curved instrument cluster forms the highest point on the dashboard. This places a clear focus on the driver axis. A central, 10.9-inch infotainment display and an optional passenger display are combined to form an integrated glass band and a black panel look. All user interfaces have been designed from scratch for the Taycan. The number of classic hardware controls such as switches and buttons has been greatly reduced. Instead, control is intelligent and intuitive, using touch operation or the voice control function which responds to the command Hey Porsche. With the Taycan, Porsche offers an entirely leather-free interior option for the first time. Interiors made from innovative recycled materials underscore the sustainable concept of the electric sports car. Foot garages, recesses in the battery in the rear foot well, ensure seating comfort for rear seat passengers while allowing the typically low roof height found on sports cars. Two luggage compartments are available. The front compartment has a capacity of 2.8 cubic feet and the rear 12.9 cubic feet.